What's going on YouTube? It's your boy Gator back with another vlog. On this here vlog, we're gonna be doing a short walk around of my Monte Carlo SS. 1985 Monte Carlo SS. So um yeah, this is for some of the new subscribers and also because we're revealing another G body to the channel soon. So uh for the new subscribers that haven't really been in tune to all the stuff I did on the MC. I do like a walk around and a brief talk about everything I had did since I purchased the car. And then, um, yeah, then we may be revealing the other G body soon, but we got to run them likes up and we also got to run them subscribers up before I reveal. So make sure y'all hit that like button. It's free. Make sure y'all hit that subscribe button. It's free. Hit that notification bell so you can be notified when I'm dropping these vlogs and make sure y'all share this type of content if your friends like it with them. You know, all that's free. So why not? Y'all stay tuned. This is my 1985 Monte Carlo SS. And we'll start with the front first. Front couch. I added those Halo Oracle LED headlights. Or should I say Oracle Halo LED headlights. I added those. I also had to put that front symbol on there when I originally got it. The color was gone on the front symbol. I added some of the uh, decal, which was I did that Chevrolet decal 24 inch 4G auto 4 piston wheel wood front disc brakes drilled and slotted I also added the SS decal off of the 87 because I just didn't like the 85 interior was already done when I got the vehicle pretty much I just had to add the strap back to the door uh, it had broke off forge out a steering wheel dash was cracked up I added that to the vehicle AC vents were cracked I added that um the dash was um all the gauges weren't weren't working now all the gauges are working but i do see this water gauge is like pegged out but yeah all the gauges are working i don't know why that temperature gauge was just pegged out with the car off it was at 260 but I crank it up once I finish doing the whole walk around. Uh, fire extinguisher I purchased from uh, AutoZone. I got the back dash did. I got DS18s and DB tweeters. Uh, what else? What else? What else? Oh, LED lights on the back. Emblems and the tail lights. I added those. They were missing. I got the LED tail lights on the license plate. I added that. These strips on the bumper. I added those. Because the other ones had was dry rotted and all raggedy. Oh, 
I redid the back drum brakes whole kit. Uh, added front shocks. I sprayed, undercoated the wheel wells, all wheel wells before the wheels got on with rust oleum. Like I say, the interior was already done when I purchased the car. Uh, that ended up breaking uh, when I got the dash pad put on. I brought it to an interior shop and they cracked that. I have another one in the trunk. I just never put it on, but it doesn't have the the door as this original one. So I was looking for the original one with the door, but I can't find any online. So. If y'all could help me point me in the right direction. I added this antenna because I didn't like the long one. Brand new windshield. To say I ain't been driving this car, it's, it lands pretty dirty. Um, that's about it. And I did a, some motor work, original mo motor. I'm going to pop the hood and let y'all check that out. Hold tight. Original 305 motor. I end up doing spark plugs, wires, distributor, fuel pump. Painted the carburetor cover. Uh, my mechanic adjusted the carburetor. Uh, I already had headers on the car when I purchased it. And I also cleaned up under the hood. And that's pretty much it. AC lines had just got done, as you can see, before I end up purchasing. He did the AC. That's about it. Let me crank this thing up for y'all. Motor runs pretty strong. 305 high output. y'all think overall make sure y'all like it's free make sure y'all hit that subscribe button it's free so i'm ready to post that new g body to the channel i'm ready to post it but we need to run them likes up and them subscribers up so share this content with a friend Make sure y'all comment on this video if y'all got an idea of what that new G-Body I'm gonna bring to the channel is. Thanks.